So I woke. I woke up as many of you have done. And you go to your YouTube channel. And you get this message that your account has been disabled due to multiple uh, copyright infringement. And then you go to another channel. It's the same thing. You go to your channels and all of your channels have been terminated because of copyright infringement. <laughs> and then I notice, I, I don't want to be redundant because we're, we're familiar with the story. And the perpetrators of this infraction is Napashada, encouraged and guided by this person, Frank Gary, or we know him as Sanetta Studio, Sanetta. Again, I don't want to be redundant because we're familiar with the story. And we know who was behind our channels getting taken down. And to be quite honest, they did what they did, but Google was happy to uh, give them the power because they always wanted us to be terminated. Every time Angel Snub Nub 7 gets a certain amount of attention, Google terminates our channels. It, it never fails because we are a threat. Sonata is not a threat. I believe somebody calls his channel, his original one of his channels, uh, Black News 101, to be terminated a long time ago. But most of these people, Google does not bother because they're not a threat. Just some happy-go-lucky channels, a bunch of folks arguing over the Bible and other nonsense that does nothing to inspire, to motivate to cause us to truly wish to change our condition once and for all. In fact, if we change the condition, Sonetta is out of business. If we change the condition, a lot of these people, all this pro-blackness, aboriginal stuff, a lot of it is out of business. They have nothing to bring to the table. They have nothing to offer. The reality is temple on earth causes you and I to think for ourselves, to reach inside ourselves, the creative people giving us vision, giving us a wanting to express our uniqueness instead of trying to be somebody that we never was or somebody from the past that we should honor and respect, but we are not them. And so I must admit, I was very angry to learn of this. Here we are on social media and the owners of the platform, which is uh, Google Incorporated or Facebook, Mark Zuckerberg and all these people, they tolerate us by law. I can guarantee you, if it wasn't for the law, 
your happy ass would not be, my happy ass would not be on YouTube or social media. Them pecker woods will keep you off with your nonsense. They don't want to hear all oh, that pro black and under black man is God and white people do this and all these conspiracy theories that we come up with and all this and that. They don't want to hear that crap. Get you, get off. But the law prohibits and stops them. But laws can be changed. And you don't support your own Facebook. You don't support your own YouTube. What you going to do? Go back to the nothingness. Really where most of these people really belong. Because you're not talking about nothing. So I was upset. And many of you heard my being angry and upset and we should be angry and upset but then I began to think about out of all the people messing with Sarnetta and I'm not thinking about this man we're not thinking about we're going back and forth with the demons of darkness ain't nobody thinking about Sarnetta in Nepal but he has us on his mind. Here's a, a person. That's supposed to have this large following. Got all kinds of stuff. That he needs to be doing. And he thinks about Angel Snub number 7. Wow. And so like the coward he is. Just in case things don't go right, because if you false flag and it's proven that the false flag was malicious and it was wrong, you get your channel taken down. So he got Nepal to do his dirty work. What a coward. What a bitch. What a sissy. What a clown. But his mind, he's thinking about Angel Snub No. 7. I'm not going to mention their names. But there's people that make videos about him every day. That's their whole purpose. Talk about Sonetta every day. It ain't bother them. You thinking about Angel Snub No. 7. This goes to show you, look, I only get, we only get 10 views, we only have 10 subscribers, but here's somebody with hundreds and thousands of listeners around the world, so you claim, and you found it necessary to come after a small nothing channel. <laughs> wow. That says a lot about us. And at first I was angry. And at first I wanted payback. And I still do to a certain point. Because that that's foul. That's wrong. But it shows us. How strong we really are. It shows us how powerful and influential we really are. That our little 10 views and our little 10 subscribers get the attention of somebody who think they are holier than thou the big stuff and he's a liar we're going to see what we can do so you can get your channels back he was telling a lie see those people are talking about Sonetta but they don't talk like Angel Snub Number 7. Because when Angel Snub Number 7 talk. I hit you to the core. It hurts you down into your very being. That's why. He can't get his mind off Angel Snub Number 7. Because I'm bringing the truth. I'm not just sitting around here. Just. Trying to find some foul stuff. No I'm telling you the truth about yourself. And that was really hurts. 
these other people, they bring a little bit of this and look. They don't bring it like we do. When people hear what we have to say about them, it hurts them to their very core because we're like an x-ray. We go into the deep heart of the subject. I'm very sure he heard our last video that we made about him because he talked about us. We call him Angel Nut Nut. You a damn lie. I'm Angel Snub Nup 7. We don't call him nothing. You call me Angel Snub Nup 7. And so I returned the favor. And broke it all down. No video response. He's, he's a coward and a punk bitch. He can't respond. Because he know I'm going to come back even harder than I was the first time. So like a snake. He's going to crawl on his belly. And use a woman. To do his dirty work. But it goes to show us how strong we are. When I said the mighty mighty. That goes to show that that's true. It goes to show the terminations, the gossip, the slander, everything that we had to deal with this year. It goes to show that when we say how powerful that we, we are the mighty, mighty, it's true. It's not talk, it's true. We proved that this year. The slander, the gossip. The channel terminations. And look where we stand. We still stand strong. We still stand proud. We still stand powerful. In religious teachings. The Quran says. Do not believe. That you will say you believe. I'm paraphrasing. And not be tried. Oh you the mighty. You think you this. You think you so that. We prove that. We proven it. We are the mighty one. We're the strong. We're the real. And the reason why we stand is because we stand on a strong foundation. We stand on the real. Channel termination. Slander and gossip. Still the mighty one. They still crying. You would think after the channel terminations. You would think. Since everybody believe what you say. Angel Snub Dub 7 should be a done deal. One of our most favorite trolls. The whole situation blows their mind. How did they how did they survive? We survive because we're strong. We survive because we're powerful. We are the most powerful voice on social media. We have the strength, we have the plan, we have the vision, we are creative. We have a goal. We got it going on. The only thing you need to do is get on the soul train. And you, you can become a winner. Stay sticking around these old foul people. Sonetta is a loser. I don't care how many subscribers he have. He's a loser. All these folks, they just a bunch of losers. So here we are. So small. Yet powerful. Can you imagine when we begin to draw the thousands and the hundreds, how powerful we we can become? Woo, man. Mm, mm, mm. Something else.